Hey guys, JH, welcome to Practice Tea. Okay, today, for something as they would term completely different. I've got a buddy of mine that uh, spends a lot of time here when I practice, and he's seen me hit thousands of golf balls. And he's from the old school. And if he said it once, he said it a thousand times. He says, JH, you swing too fast. You're too fidgety. And he's from, as I say, from the old school, the nice old slow laconic type golf swings. And I've always said to him, Pete, I can't swing slow. I'm not a slow metabolism person. And he said, well, just humor me. Just try and slow everything down and see how you go. So guys, I did. And it's basically this. If you're someone like me and you're fairly quick and agitated in the process you know you've always got the golf club moving and you're always moving that puts the club into activation mode the club head is is activated and it's ready to go okay that's not a bad thing but it can also create a lot of differential in path and um, delivery and so what I did for Pete was I said okay and I was only fooling around but I said, okay, Pete, you mean you want me to do this? Come to a complete stop. Take the club back like this and take the club down like that. And he said, yeah. And I did. And I hit it unbelievably well. And guys, I call it the... the... the gravity assist slow down process and by that I mean okay immediately I'm slowing down everything is slowing down I'm killing all that activation in the golf club killing all the energy and the excess energy in my arms and body and I'm just getting into a meltdown mode and I'm getting in here like this I'm setting my left axis but I'm setting down like that and I'm absolutely at a standstill. The same as Lee Westwood, Seve Ballesteros, Jose Maria Lathaba. They actually start from stop and move it away. Now I did that guys and I hit it unbelievably well and I've never done it before in my life. But the advantage was that when I was over the ball, I felt that I had a vertical bleed factor going on. And that is all the weight and all the tension, all the anxiety was bleeding out of me and going into the ground. Just bleeding down into the ground. As I stood there, I got heavier in the thighs and the buttocks. My neck was soft, arms were heavy, club head was very heavy. And everything was just slowing down. Time was coming to a halt. And I just set my left axis set it in there it just hit the ball now that's the first hit of the day uh, dead straight out there but that's quicker than I had it the other day what I'm endeavoring to do guys is that I'm trying to have a very very slow backswing and then I'm trying to have what I call a 50% factor on the downswing. I'm trying to slow the downswing down 50% on the downswing. Now this will be entirely different to what JH normally looks like. I'm just setting my left axis. And then I'm bringing everything to a complete halt. Guys, that's a five iron, and I can't hit it any better than that. That's just exquisite. Absolutely exquisite. Okay, so the message is for you guys that are very anxious, just slow it down. Get heavy. Let it all bleed out. Sit down into the shot. Get the left axis. Sit into it. Get the club feeling very heavy. 
bring it to a stop. Guys, I say it all the time and you hear it ad nauseum from JH, but I've never hit the ball as good as that ever in my life. And I owe a vote of thanks to uh, my buddy Pete for alerting me to, uh, to what was going on. And so guys, the whole message is, for you guys that have problems with consistency, I mean, I've hit the ball, I hit it pretty straight anyway, but this, with this process I hit it ridiculously straight and solid. And it's not hard. It's just a matter of slowing everything down. I come in, I set my left axis. Everything forward. Then I kill the club. And there it is, guys. And the guy, and the guy that got me onto this, Pete's just turned up here and he's just seen that shot and he's just shaking his head, he can't believe it. It never changes, Pete, they're just exactly the same. Uh, so guys, it's a, certainly a departure for JH, big departure for JH. But it works amazingly well, and the discipline is not that hard to achieve. So I just set my left axis. I let all the weight bleed down to China, as Mo says. Going to China. Get in here, very slow. Now the range owner here would love me because all those balls are in a, like a four yard circle. Okay guys, that's, that's basically it. It's a slow down gravity assisted golf swing. And when I say slow down gravity assisted, I mean that I'm slowing everything down, but the gravity assist is everything's falling towards the center of the earth. It's just all falling towards the center of the earth. Once I'm in here, I've set my left axis. I wish I'd met Pete uh, 35 years ago. I mean, they're just unbelievable golf shots. And I can do a dead cold, guys. I can walk in here straight after a session in the gym this morning, stiff as a board, and come in, set the left axis, bleed everything down, stop. And it just shot after shot after shot after shot. Okay guys, we'll come back and we'll just have a little... Just one more session, just a little talk about it. And I'll show you how you can implement this process into your normal game. Oh.